Hey guys, Steve here. Today I want to get on and do a quick video to show you how you, when you're building a list, this is this has to do with the power lead system, how when you're building a list and you're driving traffic to your power lead system capture page, how you can build your list and get response and the power lead system or Aweber and the power lead system. The only problem with the Aweber building both lists at the same time is that you have to... Uh, call, beg, and all kinds of stuff in order for you to get Aweber to uh, turn off the double opt-in for whatever list that you create. That's the biggest problem that that I have with Aweber. I mean, I have an Aweber account because actually you can get a free account up to 500 leads. But a sad story is a quick story is uh, before I knew that, I got the Aweber account, connected it in the back office to my Power Lead System Capture page, ran about $30 worth of traffic to it, and none of the leads, uh, actually half of the leads were unconfirmed, and then the other half, I, I was able to catch it in time and, and redirect the traffic that I was getting. So it was really, it was a waste of money, but it was my first attempt at trying to do something like that, so I mean, I took it as a learning experience, but you know, um, that's the only problem you'll have. Now, I was able to get them to remove um, to remove the double opt-in on one list, okay? So, now I just, when I do it, I would have, I just have all, all my opt-ins go to that one list. And particularly from, I think, my text bot AI, I have it all going to, uh, um, to uh, Aweber, just that one list. So, I have no sorting and by offer or whatever but in get response i do it a little different anyway i got all off subject so uh where was i oh so how do you build your get response list and power lead system or how you build your aweber list and power lead system so you can have the same contacts in both so you can have a backup so anyway this is your capture page and uh the first thing you'll do is you uh you would uh log into your aweber or get response account right and uh let's log in here and what you would do is you would um, you would create a list. I already have one created that I just created today, Aweber, the Aweb Biz Dean. So you would just click here and you hit create list and you would just title your whatever whatever your list would want to be and you you know you hit save and the and if you're setting this up for the first time, let me show you where you would get your API key because you would need it if you were setting it up. Um, so you would come down here and go to integrations API, right? And uh, you would click API. And this is where you would get your um, your API codes in order to integrate it into the power lead system or to whatever else you're trying to integrate it with. So anyway, I just wanted to show you that real quick. So let's log into the power lead system. Now, um, I'm assuming you all know what the power lead system. It is a done for you complete marketing system i don't know why my screen is doing that but it's a done for you complete marketing system that has a built-in autoresponder capture pages follow-up emails i mean you can make you can funnel hack i mean and i'll show you, i'll make a video on how to do that because it's awesome i can just take any page i want and do what i want right <laughs> it's amazing and it's very affordable um and you can make twenty dollars uh commission off of every referral and then $10 commission off of every referrals referral to where it's nonstop, you know, coming in. Most programs aren't set up like that. I mean, even though it may look a little older or whatever, uh, it's still a very powerful system. You got share codes. You can duplicate, replicate any system. Anyway, I just wanted to give a breakdown of what that is as I'm logging into this back office here. Um, so that's what the power lease system is. Uh, he gives you a breakdown here about new contact. This is a, a welcome video. This is an offer for the Traffic Master Institute that you can make $1,000 in commission on. So yes, it has high, tick, high ticket components in the back office that uh, position yourself for, right? Just be in position the best you, you can. So, uh, so the first thing I'm gonna do is, so this is the uh, capture page that I'm gonna sync with my get response email list. And it goes to the offer of this Aweb business that uh, Bones created. And a little bit about this is that 
this is excellent for newbies and I'll do a, a, a complete walkthrough a little later on in a separate video but this just an overview of this is it tells you how you can start building a list how you can start um, and you can start generating sales not only Aweber affiliate commissions but also power lead system uh, commissions. Why? Because it's a funnel that promotes Aweber as the business opportunity. So any newbie could take this, learn how to build a list, start building a list, learn how to do a capture page, and get affiliate commissions, excuse me, from Aweber as an affiliate and from Power Lead System for using that as a platform to run this business. So it's, it's <laughs> Bones is the man on these share codes. Um, I suggest you check it out in the description box below. So anyway, let's get back to where I was. So in the Power Lead system here, you'll go to websites and you'll go to web pages. And what you'll want to do is you'll want to go to the web, um, to the capture page that that was that was on, and it was this one. Uh, yeah, it was this one, <clears throat> this one for me. So I'll hit edit, and I'll scroll down here, and you see where it has this already checked, right? Add opt-in to the Power Lead System contact manager with a bout checker and send this autoresponder sequence when they opt in. And if you didn't know, this has a whole bunch of uh, already built-in autoresponders and you can always add your own. Um, so that's just another plus that not only can the Power Lead System, you create capture pages and systems, right? And build systems and get those excellent commissions but it also has that autoresponder cooked in but it has so much more and i'll check out my other videos because i i do overviews of the training and there's like secret stuff in there that people don't even touch be a product of the product that's all i gotta say be a product of the product there's so much stuff in here but anyway i keep getting off track so so anyway so when you want your your leads to come in through this capture page here and go on your Power Lead System uh, Contact Manager and your Get Response Contact Manager. What you'll do is you'll want to make sure that this is checked right here. And you want to go down here and you want to go under Campaign Manager and find your list. Now, you would have already synced it up with the API key, which I showed you how to get that. But that's why this pops up here. Because once you follow these directions here right it shows you how that get response how you sync it up okay so it's real super simple um it's real super simple right so you close and uh so once you do that you find like i said you come here it syncs up all your lists and you select which one you want to be associated with this capture page now you click this button and boom well hold up these check marks disappeared see i don't know if you noticed that when i first logged in these two were already checked, right? Saying that this opt-in page is already connected to the only the Power Lead System autoresponder and the Power Lead System contact manager. So every lead that comes in would only come here. But I wanted to go to the Get Response or the Aweber, right? So what you do is you check this, and then those two disappear. So now I'm like, oh, I guess I can't do that. But no, wait, yes you can. You just have to make sure that this one is checked first then come back up here and check those two okay now i tried to do three <laughs> i was being just you know tried to see what it do you can't do it so you then you come down to the bottom and you hit save pages to website and i'll show you you'll come back go back to edit basics and as you can see uh that's checked and these two are checked it works the same way with aweber you come in you find your list in aweber right right and you select it right and it, like i said it also has directions how to do it on aweber but if you see here it talks about that double confirmation aweber told us all subscribers being added through a third party app or api will be sent the confirmation message as a, def a default within your account you only have the ability to disable the confirmation message for subscribers added through a sign up form directly or when manually added to your account so basically what that's saying is 
any lead coming in through the power lead system has to get an opt-in, has to get a confirmation message. But if you would build your capture page in Aweber, you don't have that double opt-in. Now, that's what this business in a box that Bones created does. He showed you how to make a free Weber, a free Aweber uh, capture page like this, and I'll show you real quick, that connects directly to Aweber so you can drive traffic to this and feed your Aweber list while all at the same time promoting the power lead system and getting affiliate commissions for every sign up through Aweber, which is a genius, right? So that's how that works. But that's why the Aweber, whole Aweber thing is uh, a little tricky. And get response is totally simpler. You don't have to worry about the double opt-in form. And it's as easy as checking a button uh, and hitting save. Now, it works the same way. So like if I uncheck get response and I check Aweber, boom, those two disappear. But like I said, I want both. So I just make sure that this is checked first. Then I come up and check here and all three of them are checked and I hit save, right? And I go back and, and actually uh, you can see that they're still checked, but I don't want Aweber, so let's just undo that and uh, let's make sure my get response is turned back on. So I'll hit, uh, go back to my list that I wanted to create to for that and um, and boom, that's done. So let me hit save before I forget. And now this opt-in page, when not this one, uh, this opt-in page, which is super simple, right? Whenever I get leads in, it feeds both my Aweber, uh, not Aweber, my get response list, and also my contact manager that's in my um, uh, power lead system. So, so anyway, that's all that I got. That's all I wanted to show. And just to show you that there is a way that you can build a backup in power lead system and have still your leads going to your get response or your Aweber. So you can, you have a little bit of flexibility, uh, having two lists, you can do a little bit different kinds of segmentation and, uh, you know, uh, list hygiene, I guess. But anyway, that's all I got. I hope this was helpful. Like, share, subscribe, comment below if you got any questions and I'll help you out. That's all that I got. Thanks for hanging out. I'm out.